vehicle. Everything goes well. T minus 23 seconds. So we'll be here on the loop supporting you. T minus 15 seconds. Second umbilical tower moving away from the Soyuz. Ignition. Ignition, the first stage engines. Ready. Intermediate ready. First stage engines are at maximum thrust. Main ready, lift off. Lift off, lift off of the Soyuz spacecraft carrying Gennady Padalka, Mike Barrett, and Charles Simonier to the International Space Station. Good pitch program according to flight controllers. Small vibrations. Yes, we see that. Getting small vibrations. The Soyuz is heading toward a link up with the International Space Station two days from now. Good first stage performance. Soyuz developing 102 pounds of thrust from its fire boosters and single engine. The, view. the first stage of the Soyuz measures 68 feet in length. Everything is nominal. We're feeling well. Copy that. 24 feet in diameter as it burns for the first two minutes and six seconds of the flight. Light G loads, but nothing out of the ordinary. Just as usual. The last two times. This is your third time on this. At yes. 1 minute and 58 seconds, jettison the four strap-on boosters will occur. These will yes. have completed their job and have dropped away at an altitude of 28 statute miles. Copy. G loads are increasing. Nothing out of the ordinary. Now we see only a dot in the sky. And now we have live in-cabin views uh, aboard the Soyuz spacecraft. We're feeling well. Confirm separation. Everything is nominal. Separation. The Soyuz second stage now performing as advertised. The weather is wonderful on the ground now. Clear sky. Second stage of the Soyuz is 56 feet in length, 13 and a half feet in diameter, with a single engine providing 96 tons of thrust for its three minutes and 28 seconds of operation. Uh, bearing jettison confirm. Copy that. Do you experience uh, the jettisoning of the fairing? Yes. Yes, we uh, uh, we see the light coming through the window. Oh yes, you guys are now receiving sun. Exactly. You may get suntanned while you're flying. Yes, under the windows. And there's the small gnome hanging from the uh, ceiling of the spacecraft, uh, a memento from Gennady Padalka's first mission to the International Space Station on Expedition 9. So everything is well, feeling well, vehicle is performing well, copy all. How is uh, Simone doing? Oh, I'm doing well. Four minutes into the flight of the Soyuz and all systems performing nominally. This is your second flight. Which time was easier? Continuing the first or the second? to power up on the second stage. Uh, 
Uh, for a total of three minutes and 28 seconds. I understand my question. This is your second launch. Which launch was uh, more uh, difficult, more rough? Uh, Inaudible. We have, we have felt the separation, everything is nominal, the TV cameras came on. Four minutes, 58 seconds into the flight, the core booster burned out and separates at an altitude of 105 miles or 170 kilometers. Third stage ignition is occurring. On the uh, TV. The four liquid-fueled engines uh, that have completed their task for today are now dropping away. About four minutes of powered flights is remaining. The Soyuz is now being propelled by the single engine of the Soyuz's third stage. That engine providing 30 tons of thrust and is going to burn for four minutes and two seconds. Continuing to receive live television pictures from inside the crew cabin. Perhaps, uh, Gennady, uh, if we purchase those brand new uh, gadgets, the visibility would be better, inaudible. Uh, Vehicle nominal, we're feeling well, everything goes well. Copy. Vehicle is nominal, feeling well, everything is nominal, I copy. Copy all, everything is nominal on the ground as well. Four hundred forty seconds, copy. Altitude two hundred kilometers. Copy, approximate altitude two hundred kilometers. All is well on board. Crew members reporting current altitude is 200 kilometers. That's about 125 statute miles. All systems working well. Uh, stay in touch.